Here we have the other side of the adrenals, the cortisol. Uh, okay, then let's talk. Well, this person we already know had rapid heartbeat and they have put down a score for ra rapid heartbeat. I'm stressed out. In today's society, so many people are absolutely stressed to, to the max. This person is not too bad. Uh, and some of the autoimmune dysfunctions that show up are psoriasis, skin allergies, rashes, eczema, and Quite often when you're talking to the patient, you put them a little bit of stress and you can see the skin rashes that start to appear around the neck or on, on the face. Digestive systems, now this is the big one. We find so many young people with digestive problems. Um, that is uh, colitis, irritable bowel, and leaky gut. That's all to do with the adrenals. And easily confused. The next one is, do you wake up tired or do you wake up full of energy? The correct answer is, I wake up full of energy, I'm in bed for five to 10 minutes, I can't stand to be in bed any longer, and I want to get up and run a mar marathon. Um, these are all yes and no's, where yes equals one, no equals zero. Between 2 and 4 p.m., you shouldn't feel tired. That means that your adrenals are running out. That means that you're going past the reserves and your body is looking for other sources of energy. So you start to seek a snack, tea, coffee, Coke, or something with sugar and salt in. Um, and this is the start of an artificial form of energy. But quite often, this is where we see the lipids being drawn on as well as the blood sh sugar. And um, if we look at the long-term uh, sugar marker, the A1C, we find that it's starting to go up. And we, if we look at the lipids, the lipids are going up for no, and for no re re reason. Um, falling asleep in front of TV while um, or reading a book or in front of the computer is a big no-no. No, no. As well as, as soon as you go to bed, if you put your head straight on the pillow and you fall asleep, you have a cortisol problem. The real, the correct answer is you need to watch TV for 10 to 15 minutes or, or do something where you slowly drift off, off to sleep into la-la land. Um, now, your score here should be three. This person has a 13. So they need some sort of adrenal support. If the figure is say three to five, you can just give them some supplements. Say if it's five to 12 or 13, uh, you, they need desiccated adrenal uh, hormones. If it's 14 or over, they need to have um, a saliva test, the four times a day saliva test to see where the saliva is and or the RT3 test. This is where we pick up the reverse T3 problems.